Today I am going to show you guys how to start a party in your back office. So, um, first thing you need to do is log in. Some people forget to do that. So we are a social-based company, social media. So you're gonna click right here on your Facebook to log in and here is my page. So this is what your page is gonna look like. It should have your picture up here. If you do not have your picture up there or your Facebook connected, um, let me know and I can show you how to do that. Um, so you're just going to go right here to where it says party and click that and this should come up. You're going to go to schedule a new party. So if you are hosting your own party, you will click this one. If you are starting a party for a friend or a customer, you will click this one. And all you need is your customer's name if they are already in the system, or you click create a contact, and all you need is their name and their email. But for this purpose only, we are going to cancel this and say, I will host this party. So then this should come up. You choose your country, which should just be your given country. The reason this is there is if you have a customer from a different country hosting a party, you would click their country. And then you're going to choose your theme. And there is no right or wrong choice. This is just basically what is going to be your welcome message at the top of your party. So let's just click lipstick for this purpose. And then you will click Save My Party. So when you do this, you will get to this page where it will say, Congratulations, this party is active and ready to go. And there will be your party link. So this is what you want to share with your customers or in your party. If you need to find this link again, you just go up here to My Parties. You click that and it'll show you your list of parties. And on the left here, it will show you the last date of your party. So for example, this one, I have one day remaining and the new one I just started has 10 days. And so the parties run for 10 days. You can always close them early if you would like, but if you want to see your party page, you just click on the link here. Oh, also it shows you here what your party total is. So if I click on this one that I just created, this is what your customers or friends will see when they visit this site. And over here it shows how many days are left and when it will end. If you ever need to close a party, you just scroll down and click My Office and you go to My Parties. And if you scroll down, so the party I just created, say I made a mistake or I don't want it, I click close party. And it'll ask me, are you sure you wanna close this party? Okay. So it will do away with that party. And that is it. You will also get an email from the company saying um, what your party link is. So that is how you create a party.